besides, so it's the um, parshas Ashavua, parshas Re is always read. Besmichus uh, techoidish el, you know the Shabbos mavorchem el, like this year or on reshchoidish el itself. And therefore, according to the Shlach Kodesh, who says that Hakol Miyad Hashem Hiskil, that there's a connection between the Parsha that's read and the Inyone Hayoim, so probably there's a connection between Parsha Re'e and the Avoida of Chodesh Elul, and uh, that's what I want to explore. You know, the Rambam uh, always has a caption uh, before every group of halachas. Uh, where he he uh, lists the mitzvahs ase and the mitzvahs loisase that are included in uh, that particular group of halachas, but in the caption to Hilchis Tshuva, uh, there's an interesting lotion. The Rambam says mitzvahs ase achas. The entire body of Hilchis Tshuva contains only one mitzvah ase. Vehi she Yoshu v'achoyte mecheto ilufnei Hashem v'yisvade. Ubeur mitzvah zu, the ikorim ha nigrorim ima biglolo the prokimelu. So the Rambam says that in these halachas, I'm not only going to be mevaer mitzvah zu, but also the ikorim ha nigrorim ima biglolo. So what are the ikorim ha nigrorim ima biglolo? So we see that the uh, in Perik Hay and in Perik Vov, in Hilchis Shuvah, the Rambam uh, discusses the principle of free choice, of free will. And then in the beginning of Perik Zion, he comes back <clears throat> to the Indian of Chuva and he says, <laughs> Since we explain that everybody does have free choice, <laughs> A person should be mishtadel as his shuvah velin or kap of mechatov kedei she yomus vuhu bal teshuvah kedei she yiske v'chaye ha'olam habo, and then from Perik Chesan on he discusses olam habo and the schar va'oynish of olam habo. So obviously the ikorim hanigrorim ima biglola of chuva are the principle of free choice and schar va'oynish. So where does it say the Indian of Bechira? So the Rambam in Perikei says, the Iker Zeh, meaning the Iker of free choice, Iker Godelhu, v'hu amud ha-Torah v'ha-Mitzvah. It's the pillar of Torah and Mitzvah. Shenema, says in Parshish Nitzavim, re'ei nosati l'fonecho ha-yoyim, es-achayim ves-ha-toiv, ves-ha-moves ves-ha-ra, because and it also says, and that's in the beginning of this week's parsha, Re'ei or Noichi Noisein Lufneichem Hayoim Bracha Uklo Kloima Shoreshus Beyetchem Bechol Sheyach Poitza Odom Laatzois Mimaisa Bnei Odom Oise Bein Toivim Bein Roim Etc. So you see that twice we lay in the Indian of Bechira once in the, before Rosh Hashanah before the Aser Simei Shuvah. In Parshish Nitzavim, which is always read before Rosh Hashanah, and once before we begin the Avoida of Chesh ben Hanefesh and Shuva of Chodesh Elul, Reino Sati Lefanecha Ayoyim Es Habroche Ves Haklola, because in order to make a Chesh ben Hanefesh and to do Shuva, one needs to take responsibility for his actions. Only if we're com- we become convinced that we did and do have free choice, we're responsible for what we did, and we're able to change our ways, and therefore that's uh, the hachone for Chesh ben HaNefesh and for Tshuva. You know, the, 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 the Navi says that Dirshu Hashem behimotzoi, kra'uhu behiyoisoi korov, yazoi vrosho darkoi veish oven machshiv oisov, veyoshoiv el Hashem veyirachamehu, veel eloikeinu ki yarbe lisloyach, ki so there's a key. I mean, the, the because, because loy machshevoisai machshevoiseichem and loy darkechem the drochai, therefore, therefore, what? Therefore, Yazav Rashi Darkai. I mean, how is that in the Sinistam? 
Why Yaziv Rosh Hazarikoy? Because my thoughts are not your thoughts, my ways are not your ways. What is how does that how is that a reason for Yaziv Rosh Hazarikoy? But Bemis, if you look in the Rambam, in the end of Perik Hey, Mihilchis Shuva, Zog the Rambam, Shemo Toimar, Hoyel Vakodish Borhu, Yoidea, Komashe, Yiye, Koidim Shia, since Hakodish Borhu knows in advance what's going to happen. So Yoda, Sheze, Tzadik, Oy Roshe, Oy Lo Yoda. Im Yoda, who she yet Tzadik, he after she lay at Tzadik. Vim Toimar, she Yoda, she yet Tzadik, after she Yerosha, Hare Lo Yoda, Hadavar Al Borioi. So free choice is a steerer with Yediyah that HaKadosh Baruch Hu knows. So the Rambam sa- says, the eight, Shetshuva she'el azu arucha me'eretz midah, v'rechava mini yam, v'kama yikorim g'doylim v'harorim romim t'luyim bo. Aval tzorech ato leida v'lohovim b'dom v'zeh shani yoymer. And he says, V'ar b'yarnu b'perek sheni mihilchiz yisoy de'at toyre sh'akadosh Baruch Hu e'no yoydeya b'deya sh'hi chutz mimenu. That his idea is not a idea that's outside of him. We have no uh, grasp of that type of daya because it's outside our uh, uh, frame of reference. Yeah, Kushain, she ain't koyach ba'odam. Anyway, so the Rambam is saying that that's the answer to the contradiction between Yedi and Bechira. I mean, that 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 HaKadosh Baruch Hu at the same time knows, and at the same time we have free choice. So what enables us to accept the principle of Bechira is the recognition that loy So since the principle of Bechira is from the Ikorim Hanigrorim Ima Biglolo. In other words, Tshuva is only possible if you believe in Bechira. So Mamela, the Navi is saying, Yazoiv Rosha Darkoi Vish Oven Machshivoisov. Yeah, you're responsible for your Darkoi, you're responsible for your Machshivoisov. And you're also capable of making a change. And you might wonder, how is that possible? We know that HaKadosh Baruch Hu knows it all. The answer is, Ki, loy machshe voisay machshe voiseichem, veloy darcheichem drochoy, no Hashem. Your understanding and my understanding are two in, in two different spheres, and they have, and and, and Mimela, the, the, the Rebbein Shalom's knowledge and our Bechira is not a stira, and therefore, Ki, loy machshe voisay machshe voiseichem, veloy darcheichem drochoy, therefore, yazoy rosha darcoy, Yes, so 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 that the the reading of Parshas Re'ei Onoichi Noisim of Nechem Ayoyim is actually the Hachana for Chodesh Elul. I mean, convincing ourselves that we actually have free choice. You know, the pasuk says Re'ei Onoichi Noisim of Nechem. So they all ask that uh, the pasuk begins with a Loshin Yochit Re'ei. And continues with the Loshan Rabbin. Rei Anoichinoi saying Lifnei Chem. So, why is that? So, I want to make one suggestion that, you know, in the Hagdama of the Sefer Hatanya, he's writing about the difficulty of uh, writing a Sefer of Musa, and he writes that, Hine Sifre Hayiro Habnuim Alpi Hasechel Hoenushi. Bevadai enom shovim lechol nefesh. Ki ein hascholim vahadeyos shovos. People think in different ways. Everybody has his own psychological makeup. He responds to things in a different way and he responds to different things. He says, Vein seichel odom ze, mispoel u misoirer mima she mispoel seichel chaveri. U kumay she omru razal gabi birches chacham arozim. 
וכמו שכוזר ורמב"ן ז"ל במוחמד שם, בפירוש הספרי גבי יהושע, שנאמר בו איש אשר רוח בוי, שהוא יאכל לה הלוך נגד רוחו של כל אחד ואחד. So Avada, people respond to different types of his oirus, and therefore Sifra Yira, that Abnuyim al Piseich al Anushi, are not uh, one size fits all. Somebody has to find something that talks to him. But he writes this about, first of all, Sforim that al Piseich al Anushi, but then he goes on to say, El afilo b'Sifra al Yira, asher yisoidosom baharerei koidesh, midroshei chazal, asher ruach Hashem diber bom, umilosoi al shoinom, That's in a general way for the general for the general cloud. ואף שניתנו תוירו לידורש בכלל ופרט ופרוטי פרוטס לכל נפש פרוטס מישראל. There is really a way to find your place in the תוירו. לכל נפש פרוטס מישראל המושרשת בו, הרי אין כל אדם זויכה לי אס מכר מקוימוי הפרוטי שבתוירו. So there's a challenge to find the מקוימוי הפרוטי שבתוירו. And you could be learning תוירו, trying to be מסוירו, And it's not working for you because you haven't found in Torah what in particular talks to you, to your Nisham. So, so, so the Mabel Lipsha is like this, that the Re'eh, the Re'eh is really a very personal thing. It's individualized. The Noisin Lefnei Chem Ayoyim, that's for everyone. Everybody can reach Chaim and Toiv and Mavis and Ra. But the Re'eh, Yeah, everybody has to find his own path. He has to find his way. He has to find how he can bring himself closer. And therefore, that's personal, and therefore, it's Lashen Yochid. That's one suggestion. We could also say, we could also say, you know, that uh, the, the Rambam, I mean, we can buy it from the Gemara, the Rambam, it says that the Rambam, it says that it says that so Really, it's Re'ei Anoichi Noisein Lefnechem. Every individual has to carry the weight of the Noisein Lefnechem. You personally are responsible for the state of the entire Umo, of the entire world. And therefore, it's Re'ei Anoichi Noisein Lefnechem Ayoyim Brocha Uklolas HaBrocha HaShetishmu. You know, What's the Lushen of Lefneichem? It's not Biyedchem. It's not Lachem. It's Lefneichem, before you, in front of you. So I think that the Sifri is addressing this Dikduk, because the Sifri on the Posik says, uh, without explaining what provoked this uh, statement, but the Sifri says, Moshe Lechot, Shehoya Yoishev B'Parosh HaZdrochit, V'hoyu L'fon Af Shnei Shvilim, אחד שתחילו סוי מישור בסוי פוי קויצים, ואחד שתחילו סוי קויצים בסוי פוי מישור. והיו מוידיע אס האוברים ואס השווים ואוים אלוהם, שאתם רואים שביל זה שתחילו סוי מישור, it looks all good. But I want you to know that it's כשתיים ושולוש פסיס אתם מהלך במישור, וסוי פוי לוצייס בקויצים, ואתם רואים שביל זה שתחילו סוי קויצים, You should know that Kishtayim v'sholish p'siyas at the mahalach b'koytzim, but v'soifoy li'oiz b'mishor. Kach, oma lahem Moshe li'yisrol, atem royem eser ashoim sh'ei matzlichim. Kishtayim v'shloy sh'yom imei matzlichim b'olam hazeh, v'soifon li'docho iz b'achroino, and the Sifri goes on. So that might be the taitz that re'ei onoichi noisein l'fneichem. In other words, the emes in the here and now, sometimes you don't see what's toiv and what's ra, what's chayim and what's moves. It's lefneichem, you have to, it's, you have to look ahead. 
you have to see the long term and 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 choose what's good and what 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 gives you life in the long term and and not just uh, what 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 appears here and now to be good but nevertheless it says you or it's lefnechem but what i'm putting befnechem in the long term the re has to be here and now today you know in parshas veschanon we have a pasuk that says by itzavenu hashem lasay says kol achukim oheila liyiras hashem alekenu letoiv manu kol hayomim lechayoseinu kehayoyim haze. So lechayre, if this brings letoiv manu kol hayomim that uh, we'll have good all our days. So my kamashmul on lechayoseinu kayoyim haze that it grants us life today. What's kehayoyim haze? It's an interesting lesson. Lechayoseinu kehayoyim haze. Do you know that Rashi in Parshas Vayeshev? By the Maisu with Yosef and the Ages, by Tifa, it says, Vayihi kahayoy maze, Vayovoy habayso, Lasseis malachtoi, Vayin ish me anshi abayis shom babois. So, what does it mean, Vayihi kahayoy maze, Zox Rashi, Koloima? Vayihi kashe, Gia yoy meyuchot. It was a special day. Yoim tzchoik, Yoim aid shelohem. It was some kind of a Yoim aid, She kulom holchu lebeis avay dezor. Omro, ain li yoim hogun. So means this is the most opportune time. This is the most appropriate day. This is the best opportunity. Yeah, that's kehayoy mazeh. Rashi is teaching that he kehayoy mazeh when a day came, which was a day that there's no other day like today. This is the best opportunity. <clears throat> so the fiza we can teach. That the Latoiv Lonu Kola Yomim. Yeah, how do, how do we achieve that? That's if we feel every day that by Itzavenu Hashem Lasi says Kola Kukuma Ela, the years Hashem Alekenu, is the Chayoisenu, Kahayoy Mazet. That only Yoim Hogun, Kahayoy Mazet. Every day is the best opportunity. There's no day that's better than today. That's the Kahayoy Mazet. When a, when a Yid lives a life of Lechayoisenu, Kahayoy Mazet, like that, then he will be zoiche to reach the latoiv lonu kol ayomin. You know that earlier in Pashas Vayeshev on the Pasik that the Yosef Furad Mitzroyma Vayikneu Paitifa. So uh, Rashi brings from Midrash Chazal that it's Kedei Lismoich Maise Shel Ishtoi Shel Paitifa the Maise Tomo. Loy Malacho Mazu Lushem Shemaim Neskavno. Just like Tomer was Neskav L'Shem Shemaim, Avzu L'Shem Shemaim. Eishas Paitifa. Shero aso be'itztar lugin shelo, sh'asido laham et bon im imeno, ve'eino yoidas im imeno im ibito. Sh'osid, yeah. So, they bring in the name of the Rebbe Reburchel Mimezhebish, that he said that if they showed her that, probably they showed him that too. In other words, that Yosef also saw that in the future he's going to be Mamid Bonim from the Aishas Paitifa. And he also didn't know how that's going to come about. So, so and that was Kedei Lahagdil Hanisoyan. So, what was the Nisoyan? The Nisoyan obviously was that even though he felt that it seems that in the end he's going to fall and he's not going to be able to be Amid in the Nisoyan, but as long as he can hold on. <clears throat> he held on. In the end, it all turned out to be otherwise. So that's the principle of kahayoy it's, mazeh. It's not about, in, in terms of what you pick, what you choose, what you do, it's not about the long term. It's about the short term. The l'toiv lonu is kalayon, but the l'chayoy seinu is kahayoy mazeh. In other words, right now, I could be oymid, I'm oymid. What's going to be later that's that's that, that 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 that's about that's about later, you know. I once heard it's, it's a little bit in, 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 it's a little bit in the same vein, a little bit in a different context. That the, the stipler once said to somebody that every person has the ability to uh, to deal with the difficulties that he's that he's given. The Rebbeinu Shalom doesn't give somebody uh, difficulties 
that he can't uh, that he can't handle. And if if a person really can't handle the difficulties, is because he's not just experiencing the difficulties that he has, but he's thinking about what's going to be tomorrow and, and what's going to be the day after. He says, "You only have the koyach. You only have the koyach to deal with the problem that you have right now. The problem that you'll have later, the Rebbeinu Shalom will give you koyach later." But now you have to just deal with what you have today. So that's Bechlal in Tzoros and Yisurim and everything that, that a person could be over. And, and Memele, the Pshad is like this. And, and, and so it's also in Ruchnius that a person has the Koiches to be Oymid in the Nisoyen of now. If he factors in the future, he, he doesn't have the ability to deal with it. But if he doesn't factor in the future, if he knows that it's L'chayoseinu Kayoim Hazeh, so that's the Re'eyo Noichi Noise L'fneichem Hayoim Rocho Klola. It's not about tomorrow. It's not about yesterday. It's about today. And 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 the Emmela, Emmela a person has to always be mischadesh. You know, we have a halacha in Hilchis uh Basabakolov that a lav ben yoimo is a nice tam of gam. Yeah, so so a tam of yesterday is is not only that it's it doesn't enhance the tam Lamal Yusa, it's it's it, it's negative, right? So the tamu Uru ki toy vashem also shouldn't be the time of yesterday. The time of yesterday is a spoiled time already. The time of yesterday is a nice and time of gum. A person has to have the ability to be mischadish every day and to uh, and to make today meaningful. And Mamela, if you'll have the Lachayoseinu Kayoy Mazere, so then you'll be Zoicha to uh Kayoilomabo. Okay, Rabbi Sai. So I want to wish you all a good Shabbos and I get a-